Nothing gets past the fans of Westeros, even if it occasionally gets past the HBO production team. The new Game of Thrones prequel series House of the Dragon sets up a different but equally fascinating world of political machinations revolving around the Targaryen dynasty 200 years before the events in the main series. With the number of dragons spotted steadily rising, the series is as fantastical as advertised, but comparisons with Game of Thrones can also be a double-edged sword. Despite years of high-quality programming, any errors the original show made remain in the minds of hardcore fans. Dedicated viewers of Game of Thrones will recall that in Season 8, Episode 4, The Last of the Starks, a modern coffee cup was accidentally left on set in a scene that takes place at the Stark home of Winterfell. After fans pointed out the gaff, it was quickly and decisively disappeared. Unfortunately for House of the Dragon, the new series seems to be following suit. Though in some ways House of the Dragon is attempting to fix the divisive plot points of the final season of Game of Thrones, the prequel has also made a highly visible mistake that is hard to ignore. In a fantasy series like House of the Dragon, visual effects are of the utmost importance. Mythical creatures and bloody carnage are what makes Westeros go round. But even more imperative are the small effects needed to create the believability of the world. And deliver this to Prince Damon yourself. In Season 1, Episode 3, second of his name, fans caught sight of a green screen glove visible on Viserys' hand. King Viserys, played by actor Paddy Considine, seems to have been carrying a hidden affliction for the entirety of House of the Dragon thus far. While it's still not entirely clear what is making him ill, It's a small cut from sitting the throne. The glove was obviously part of a CG effect intended to show that the ruler is missing two fingers. Viserys' supposed missing fingers wrapped in the green screen tape were obviously meant to be edited out. On the plus side, we live in a time where this mistake doesn't need to be permanent, as streaming services have been known to go back and correct errors in previous episodes for precisely this kind of issue. Our director, Hawk Richter, reminisced about the Game of Thrones coffee cup debacle in an interview with Variety. Things can get forgotten on set. It was so blown out of proportion because it has not happened with Thrones so far. We must learn to face it with a stiff lip. Game of Thrones said goodbye to the coffee cup, and it seems that House of the Dragon will follow suit. It won't be long before the image will be scrubbed from the internet. Viserys' maggot-eaten fingers will be digitally erased as was always intended. And as executive producer Miguel Sapochnik explained to The Hollywood Reporter, the Westeros crew maintain a sense of humor about such mishaps. He challenged viewers, See if you can see where the Starbucks cups were that we removed digitally after the fact. And if you can find one, there is a prize.